All right, everyone. So almost immediately after the loss to the Ravens, Dak Prescott sent a message to those doubting the Cowboys. Here's what he had to say. So the, I, I think this is the frustrating part for Cowboys fans and for everyone is Dak played pretty well, actually, I thought against the Ravens. But th the frustrating part of this whole thing is this kind of tired routine of, well, you know, just watch, you know, just just see what we'll do. Right. Keep that on us. Jump off the train. And it's like, well, OK, people have been doubting you for some time. Right. There's been people in the press. You know, this channel has been very pro Dallas Cowboys in the sense we've defended against the media's narrative because we're like, hey, this team's winning a lot of regular season games, which is more than a lot of franchises can say. I know they haven't had a playoff success, but, you know, look, they've had success in the regular season, at least give them that kind of credit. So we've been defending them. But then you see this and you go, OK, well, so for the past three seasons, right, let's take the past three, counting this one. So two years ago. They lose in the, against the 49ers in the playoffs. Now, that was a game I thought they really had a good chance of winning if Tony Pollard doesn't get hurt. I don't blame them for that, actually. I think that was a pretty good season. Um, but they lost. And bottom line is, that's all that matters. So we moved to the next season, and everybody was doubting, right? They were getting mocked, just like they were in the prior year. And all they had to do is say, look, we're going to lock in. And this year, we're going to prove everyone that the injury was what cost us last year. And what did they do? They won 12 games. They set themselves up for a very good, you know, playoff. They ended up winning the NFC East. So, that you know, they were just in a good position. And what do they do? They lose to the Packers at home in embarrassing fashion. So this kind of stuff is just getting old a little bit and tired. And I like Dak. I think he's a very good quarterback. I think he's even better as, a you know, like in terms of he's a great quarterback. But I think he's such a good person, which is a huge part of being kind of the leader of the team. I think he's like perfect in that sense but he's got to get these guys on track here i mean cd lamb that fumble how costly was that especially considering what happened late where it was only a three-point game i mean the defense just getting gashed and i know that's not his fault he's on offense but you know be the leader here like don't say jump off if you want please please well we're just going off what we're seeing on the field you know i want to see the cowboys succeed i want to see the cowboys in a super bowl because this is a team that, you know, I'm rooting for, but it's just kind of shocking, you know, to constantly hear this. And at some point you just tune it out, right? You're like, okay, here we go again. Yeah. Doubt us. Sure. We'll see what happens. And then it's like, okay, another first round exit or, you know, thing that you just come up short again, like that's part of the problem. So we'll see. I mean, I'm sure they're going to take all this out in the giants on Thursday, but you never know. Thank you all for watching and we'll see you next time.